Hi everyone, we're here at Tensegrity Physical Therapy with Sean Dorman, physical therapist and also the owner of Tensegrity Physical Therapy. We're here today because a soccer player is coming in with a hamstring injury and we're going to watch from beginning to end uh, how the treatment is going to go. Come along for the journey. Tell me about what brought you in today. Um, so, I had a game earlier, two weeks ago, and I was going on the sprint and I felt a little snap at the back of my leg. Okay. Is this, have you injured your, your I, I, I have before? prior injured my hamstring before. Okay. It, it just keep recording again. Okay. When this happened, did you hear anything? Oh yeah. Okay. Did you immediately fall down or have to stop or did yeah. you keep going through? I did. Immediately stop? Yeah. Okay. So for about the last two weeks, have you been, what have you been doing? Um, just been icing it. Icing? Yeah. Does it feel like the pain's gone down a little bit? Um, a little, yeah, it has. Okay. When I try to make certain movements, I could feel this just a pinch. Pinch. Just okay. Pinch does there. this does this pain feel like it's kind of in the middle of the back of the leg, or is it really high up, kind of yeah. close to the butt? It's really high up. Really high up. Okay. Yeah. It sounds like I've got a couple ideas of what may be going on. Um, let's let's do some evaluation, kind of get a chance to see where we're at. What's your goals? What do you want to get back to? What level are you playing soccer at right now? Um, well, I just want to get back to you know playing competitively. Okay. You know, so so we really need to get you yeah. back to where you were before. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah. Let's see where our starting point is and I'll give you an idea of how long it will take. Hamstrings can be a little tricky sometimes because it makes you feel like, hey, I'm good to go. And then they come and get you again. I injured prior and I thought I was, you know, you know, all good. And then I was like, let me go on the sprint. I went on the sprint and Came again. And it came again. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's really, really common. So let's let's uh, take your shoes off. You can toss them over here, and we're gonna get started. Okay. What I want you to do is just really gently pull this leg back. Good. Does this ever happen to the opposite side, or is it just this one side? Um, I I did pull my left hamstring too. You did quite a long time ago. Okay. Let's go on on your back. This one's really stiff, actually. Let's go here, put this right there and let this kind of fall. Nice, good. As I bend it and have you just kind of pull back just a smidge, good, relax. It feels like there might be some fascial tearing in through here, it's definitely irritable hearing the pop. Is, is obviously an indicator with that immediate pain that something tore within the muscle fibers itself. Now we just need to determine at what, at what degree or what level tear it may be. And do a little pull. Good. Good. Beautiful. Nice. Because this has happened on both sides and this is not the first time, I want to be very certain that you're good to go before I give you clearance. Does that sound like a plan? Perfect. So Mo, this, this here is Armando from FC Game Changers. He's going to be helping us working together as like a personal trainer and working up with you with these tools that we'll get started with. The first one we're going to do is right on over here. It's called the EMG, Electromyographic Unit. It's going to, it's going to go right on the muscle both sides, left and right, so we can get a good comparison. And it's gonna show, it's not strength, what it's gonna show is how much conductivity does the does that muscle get right now. So on this side of the screen mode is gonna be the left hamstring, on this side is gonna be the right hamstring. So make sure you're just using the injured one and just drive that heel into the ground. And go, 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 go. So what you're gonna see here on that left side, push, see this push, push, green push, 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 spike that's happening? That's how much activity is going to that muscle right now. Good. As hard as you can. Go, 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 Keep it going. Go, 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 there's definitely a, a difference. And again, at this phase of your rehab, we're not trying to push so hard. We're just trying to get things stimulated and started. So if there's pain, 
Let's back it off a little bit. There'll be a time when you can push through pain, but this is still in that early phase of rehab here. And go. Push, 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 push. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep the feet into the ground. Good. Drive the knees out. Push, 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 push. 10 seconds. One up. Good. Take a quick break. And why are you shaking? <laughs> Drive. There you go. Push. Okay, Mo, we're gonna do a RDL, Romanian deadlift. Okay, go right there so you can look at me from the side. Okay, you're gonna walk up to the barbell. You're gonna do a quick hinge and grab the barbell. Okay, make sure that upper back is set. You're gonna come up and step back. One, two steps. Okay, get your stance. Now, Think of this movement being a full body movement. You're gonna drive your shoulder blades back, set your upper back, now you're gonna hinge through the hips, keeping the barbell as close to you as you can. You're gonna go right below the kneecap. From here, you're gonna push your hips through, squeezing the glutes, and you're gonna go again. One, two, one, two, one, two. Okay, make sure that your arms are following what your legs are doing. Ready, go. Quick. Good. And back again. There we go. How does that feel? Okay. Now you're gonna go sideways. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. There we go. Nice. Go, 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 go. There you go, nice. Well done, did you feel good? No, so what this is gonna do is, we're gonna do your left side first, since you're very close to being cleared and your rehab's going really well. To really be sure, we're gonna be able to get some very specific numbers of how strong you are from front to back, with your quad index, and what I'm really looking for is that the left side and the right side are very close. The, the number we're looking for is within 10%. So this is strength. This is gonna be, I want you to push, pull when you when you go. Like this, kick. Kick. Back. Pull back. Keep going. Good, so this going. right there is your practice. Does that feel good? Yeah. All right, you're gonna tuck underneath you all the way. When that beeps, you just go as hard as you can until I tell you to stop. Ready? Go, 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 push, 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 all the way, forward, back. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, go, 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 go. As hard as you can, you're almost there. Got two more good ones. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Good, relax. Go, kick, pull, kick, pull, kick, pull, good. Go, 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 Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Good, good, you're halfway there. Halfway there, go. Keep going, keep going. Faster, faster. Go, 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 go. Good, rest. Relax. Excellent. Yeah. Your right side's rotated more than the left side. And my, my guess, my estimate of what's probably going on there when I did my little assessment of you, your left pelvis and hip felt more tight to me than the right one. So what happens is as you reach forwards, that tightness creates like a little bit of a rotation. What I'm seeing as you're going through, when you land on that left side, boom. See how right when you land, see this pelvis? See this line here? And the reason I have you take your shirt off is because that should stay straight. Mo, we're finally here. You passed on all the tests and you're pretty much ready to go. So tell us, what did you think? Um, I feel great. I feel super blessed to be working with you guys, Sean, Mando, and Ben Security. You guys have absolutely done amazing work you know, for me. And I can't wait to get back on the field and crush it.